Welcome back to CBTV. I'm Sydney. And I'm Miranda. We, we are, are your CBTV CBTV anchors. We would like to start the day off by wishing Emmanuel and Jacobet a very happy birthday. Come to the office for your birthday pencil after CBTV. Here's this week's question of the week. What mountain range runs along the east, eastern United States? Please turn all answers into orange box to Mr. Thompson. The winner will be picked this Friday. Next we have Ashley with today's weather. Look for temperatures to climb this afternoon as clouds disperse. Highs will get into the upper 50s. Tonight we will fall into the low 40s. Tomorrow we are looking at a windy day. Have a great evening, Crusty students. Back to you, anchors. This Wednesday night is Jet's Pizza Night for Crestview. Come to Jet's Pizza and earn money for our school. Make sure to give the coupon to the person that's taking your order. The class that has the most participation by the end of the month will win a pizza party. Here's your look at this week's picture of the week. Put all answers in the green box in Mr. Tom's room. Make sure to include your name and teacher with your answer. The winner will be announced on Friday. Next, we have a third grade commercial break. If you want the best, if you want best football in town, then come to JJL Sports. We got helmet, trailer pet, and cleat. More with the best price around. If you want, if you want the best, then come to JJL Sports, located on Crestview Drive. We, we put the, the G in game. game. Next, we have today in history. Today in 1951, the first long-distance telephone call without operator assistance was made. In 1954, the Iwo Jima Memorial was dedicated in Arlington, Virginia. And in 1969, Sesame Street premiered on PBS TV. Next we have Jalen with today's sports moment. It was all about Jay Cutler last night as the Bears took on the San Diego Chargers. Early on, it looked as though Jay Cutler was going to have one of his typical games when he threw a 68-yard pass that was intercepted. But near the end of the game, it was Cutler who kept the Bears' hopes alive by avoiding Charger Rush. It was Zach Miller who caught an impressive 75 yards pass close to the end um, to put the Bears up to 22-19 over the Chargers. The Bears are now three and five as the Chargers fall to two and seven. For your sports moment, I'm Jalen. Back to you, Ingrid. Today's style of the day comes from businessman W. Clement Stone, who once said, "Aim for the moon. If you miss, you may hit a star." Thank you for listening. I'm Sydney, and I'm Miranda. Have a great Tuesday. Take care of yourself and, and stay, stay responsible, responsible, respectful, and safe. Hi, Miss Nealis. <laughs>